Prep Football Game of the Week is presented by Baldwin Bone & Joint, keeping you in the game. Sports medicine and expert orthopedic care to patients of all ages. Baldwin Bone & Joint. The annual battle for the Jubilee Cup Friday night between the Daphne Trojans and the Fairhope Pirates. A defensive struggle in the first half of play. The Pirates with a stop there. The Daphne Trojans stopping the Pirates drive as Baker comes up with the INT. And again, this one a defensive struggle. One reason, Devin Mitchell, the Pirates starting quarterback, out with a hamstring pull. He didn't play at all. His replacement for the second week in a row, Riley Leonard, the sophomore, had a great outing. Takes this one on the quarterback draw deep inside Daphne territory. The Pirates couldn't get a touchdown, but they come up with a Sam Rayburn field goal and take a three to nothing advantage into halftime. Prep football game of the week is presented by Baldwin Bona Joint, keeping you in the game. Sports medicine and expert orthopedic care to patients of all ages. Baldwin Bone and Joint. Hi, my name is Dr. Charles Gordon, and I'm a minimally invasive spine surgeon at Baldwin Bone and Joint. If you've injured yourself with any of your sports and have pinched nerves or herniated discs in the back or neck, call Baldwin Bone and Joint today to schedule an appointment to see me, and we'll get you on the path to recovery. Again, I'm Dr. Charlie Gordon at Baldwin Bone and Joint, and I specialize in minimally invasive spine surgery. I hope to see you soon. In the second half of play, the Pirates come out fast and furious. Riley Leonard out to Jackson Turner, who takes this one inside the five-yard line. And then a couple plays later, it's Demel Bell in for the touchdown. And the Pirates with a 10 to nothing advantage in the third quarter of play. Still in the third quarter of play, more offense from the Pirates and more Demel Bell. Watch him here as he absolutely runs over the Daphne defense, second effort, third effort, and takes this one down to about the 10 yard line. Then the pitch to Demel Bell. He tries for the corner, can't quite get into the end zone, but later on, Braxton Jordan with the Wildcat formation jumps over for the score. This one looked like a blowout, 17 0, the Pirates on top. No quit in the Trojans, though. They come storming back in the second half of play. Watch Dante Lee here. Catches the pass, bounces off Pirate tacklers. Almost takes this one for the score, but he is caught around the 20-yard line. But the Trojans would get on the board their first score of the night as Trent Battle goes to Christian Williams in the corner of the end zone for the score. It was 17-7. Fourth quarter, more Trent Battle. He takes this one in himself for the touch and it was a 17-14 game. The Pirates up by three. Daphne goes for the home run ball in the fourth quarter. Almost picked off, but they settled for a Diego Giardo field goal just inside the upright and suddenly we're tied at 17 apiece. The Daphne defense keeps up the pressure. Marion Collins on the sack of Riley Leonard. Trojans had a chance to win it in regulation, but a bad snap on the Diego field goal, and we're going to overtime at Majors Field. In overtime, Daphne's try for the field goal just wide of the left upright, and Sam Rayburn able to knock through his field goal. The Pirates for the second year in a row win over the Trojans in overtime the final Friday night, 20 to 17, Fairhope over Daphne. Uh, I felt a little pressure, but we go through every Thursday in practice. We have a play the game script, and uh, it always it, it like wins with a game-winning field goal pretty much. So I was prepared, and I knew my coaches and teammates had my back. So We were excited to get the win. We had a great, great game plan going into the game. You know, Daphne's a great team. They came back in the second half. You know, our defense held them up. You know, Sam kicked the field goal, and we ended up winning. Man, seeing this. It made me feel like my team really worked hard and accomplished something today. Going against Daphne, yeah, it's a robbery week. Yeah, they, they got good good people on their team. But, you know, my team came out, we executed, we did what we supposed to do, and we got the win. It's a big game, and it was a big victory. And, you know, we all came out and played our hearts out all four quarters. Great effort, great effort by both teams. Uh, you know, three nothing at the half. 
Uh, they scored 17, we scored 14 in the second, goes to OT for the second year in a row, and we were fortunate enough. We won the toss, got to play defense, and were able to kick it to win it. So uh, just real proud of our guys. Prep Football Game of the Week is presented by Baldwin Bone & Joint, keeping you in the game. Sports medicine and expert orthopedic care to patients of all ages. Baldwin Bone & Joint.